This video shows how I set up my camping cot and how I have resolved the most frustrating part which is getting the last bar in place. There are several similar cots on the market including Coleman and others but they are basically the same. So the first thing I do is I get the two loose bars out of the bag and set them aside. It will make taking the cot out of the bag much easier. Then I take the cot out of the bag, uh, holding it sort of in the middle. It is a little heavy, but if you hold it in the middle, it will make it easier. Next thing I do is I set the middle set of legs kind of on top of my foot, and I unfold the outer legs so that the cot ends up uh, flat on the ground. Now, if your fabric gets stuck in one of the joints, you might have to refold the cot a little bit to get the fabric out without ripping it. Okay, stretch the fabric as much as you can. It will make uh, putting in the crossbars much easier. Next thing is to figure out which way the cot will go into the tent. In this picture, left is where the legs will go, right is where the head will go. Now what I'm trying to show here is that those two loose bars are of different lengths for some reason. So what I do is I take the shorter one and I insert it where the legs will go. Now this bar will go in just like they tell you to do in the instructions, clip it on one side, push it down a little bit and insert the other end into the two little bolts. Now on this side where the head will go, um, I do not try to insert the bar into the two little um, bolts sticking out because it's, it is a nightmare to get, to get it in and even more difficult to get it out. So what I do is I place the bar under, underneath the two long bars and I, and I secure it in place by just having it underneath. It will keep the cot open and it will actually make it a little more comfortable to sleep on. Now since I have a truck tent I, I uh, have to lift the cot up, I grab it in the middle and I place the front legs onto the truck bed and the middle legs I grab it at the end now and I kind of walk the cot into the truck. And that's about it.